Hey guys, did you all get a chance to catch your breath? That was a doozy. Um, Texas State fell to Louisiana Tech 62 to 55. Texas State nearly pulled the upset of the 18th, 19th, or 20th ranked team in the nation, depending what poll you look at. 18th in the coaches poll, 19th in the AP, and 20th in the BCS. This game, as I just said, was a wild one. The teams combined to score 117 points, 69 first downs. They ran 178 plays for 1,204 yards. Um, they were perfect combined, 13 of 13 in the red zone. Louisiana Tech getting 8 of 8, uh, while Texas State had 5 of 5. Um, huge game for Texas State tonight to prove that they can, they can hang with uh, one of the best teams in the nation, one of the higher scoring offenses in the nation. Um, I don't know if they had a lot to do with how bad Louisiana Tech's defense was or the Bobcats were clicking on all cylinders, but the Bobcats, they uh, ran 39 times for 296 yards. They threw 20, 38 times, completing 22 passes for, check that, 281 yards. Uh, Louisiana Tech ran 55 times for 283 yards. They had two running backs. Uh, Ray Holly led all rushers with 145 yards on 27 carries. Uh, Kenneth Dixon had 144 yards on 21 carries. Dixon broke an NCAA record tonight. He scored his 24th total rushing touchdown of the season. That shatters a former single season mark for a freshman, formerly set by Marshall Falk back in the er mid 90s and Ryan Williams of Virginia Tech back in 2009, and uh, Colby Cameron, quarterback for Louisiana Tech, also set a national record. He broke former uh, North, North Carolina State and former um, Wisconsin quarterback Russell Wilson's career attempts, consecutive attempts without an interception. Uh, he did that with a touchdown pass, actually, on a sixth pass today. Um, that was a four-yard pass to R.P. Stewart uh, to tie the game at 7-all. Um, the Bobcats were victimized by penalties all night. 13 penalties for 125 yards. They just seemed like they could not get out of their own way once again. Um, but anyway, Texas State, they fell behind. Let's see. It was 48-34, to 34, and a lot of people said, okay, this one is over. But the Bobcats fought back. They answered with a 22-yard touchdown run by... Uh, by Terrence Franks off a great pitch by Sean Rutherford. That made it 48-41. to And then Rutherford threw his second touchdown pass of the afternoon, of the night, I'm sorry, to Bradley Miller to tie it at 48-all. Brad and uh, Sean were saying in the post-game press conference that they spoke, on the, they spoke on the sideline before that drive. And Brad went over to Sean and said, if you put the ball where it needs to be, I'll catch every single one. And that was the case. Uh, Bradley Miller finished with five catches. For 65 yards and two touchdowns, um, it was a huge night for him. Big night for Jafis Gaines as well, the redshirt freshman wide receiver who also serves as a kick returner. Uh, he had three three returns for 106 yards. He broke off broke off, excuse me, a 65 yarder uh, earlier in the game that set up a big touchdown for Texas State, and they matched Louisiana Tech score for score. Um, it says 62-55, and fell, fell behind by 14, but. You know, it came down to an onside kick that Texas State was unable to get. Uh, that came with a minute and seven seconds remaining in the game. Louisiana Tech was able to kneel it out. Um, big game for Texas State. They got themselves back on the national radar. There was the ESPN's upset alert. It was an upset alert from everybody. I believe Texas State was even trending on Twitter. Um, but this gives the Bobcats a lot of hope that they put up 577 yards of total offense Let's see, what was it? One week after putting up 158 in the combined in the entire game, Texas State also came into this game only scoring seven points in this last six quarters. 55 tonight. Hopefully, Texas State is going in the correct direction. Next week, they go to Annapolis, Maryland to face Na the Naval Academy. And um, Texas State better shore up that run defense once again because Navy will be coming with that wishbone triple option. Um, once again, guys, this was uh, Tyler Maple with a, with a post-game video blog. Uh, Texas State fell to the 18th, 19th, or 20th ranked Louisiana Tech Bulldogs 62-55 to at Bobcat Stadium. Talk to you later.